hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel my name is abisola in today's video i'm going to be showing you how to make authentic nigeria fish roll you know that sound fish pie uh, uh, this is that snack that person was selling that he said that he made that sound fish pie anyways this is fish roll the first thing you want to do is to boil your mackerel fish with the spices listed in the video you're going some onions and then you add some water to boil sorry that spices part was very fast i didn't know i was not recording but anyways guys i listed the spices in the video and also in the caption below now we're going to do the pastry itself and which is the flour we're going with some baking powder i will then go in with some sugar and also i'll go in with some milk yes so we're mixing the dry ingredients first before we mix the wet ingredients with the dry ingredients so now and then i'm going to go in with um what's the name some salt to balance the taste then i'll just give this a good stir with my whisk and then i will go in with some margarine so i use simas margarine here for those that want to know the exact margarine i use i use simas margarine and then i'll just give it a good stir i will stir in a way that it will give me that meat pie crumbs kind of flour texture before i go in with my other liquid ingredient which is egg so guys don't worry the list of the ingredient are in the caption below and all its measurements are also included in the caption so don't worry you don't have to worry about the um, measurement then going with some water mix together make a good dough like this so you want to add you want to mix everything very well and please don't add too much water because you don't want to have runny um do so the measurement for the water i used to is in the caption you don't have to worry and you follow my measurement you are, you are, you are on, <laughs> on the right track now my fish is done so i'm just going to take it out of the boiling water like this as you can see and the next thing i want to do here is to shred my fish remove some bones that will be present in it and shred because of course we can't put this old fish inside the fish roll so you scatter your fish like this as i'm doing just with fork you can do that and you can use your hand if you feel like doing that but it's just so easy to do with fork because you know in no time you are done so guys if you have watched this video to this point that means this video is very helpful and you are learning one or two from this video have you subscribed to my youtube channel yet if you haven't please kindly subscribe to my channel and also drop a comment for me in the comment section i'll respond to your comments and also <clears throat> like and share my video i will really appreciate now let's make this sauce so into my pot i went some vegetable oil i went in with some onions minced onions so i'll give it a good stir so that the onions will be fragrant and nice and then i'll go in with some scotch bonnet pepper as you can see scotch bonnet pepper is called rodo in yoruba so this is also um chopped pepper so i just went in with the chopped pepper so now i'm just going to go in with the fish that we shredded earlier so at uh, this point our fish pie is almost getting ready always excited honestly follow my recipe for this fish pie and on you will be on like you will make the sweetest and the most delicious fish pie ever <laughs> I'm telling you, I said with my food chest. Now you stir together before you now go in with some of your seasoning. So I'm going to be using some seasoning for this and salt. And then I will check for taste. Then I will now stir again to let the seasoning marry each other very well. And the seasoning and the fish will marry each other. So guys, what is your favorite Nigerian snack that you like me to share next? The recipe see that bone eh? all these bones are very stubborn it's still found there it's way inside the spice i'll be inside the sauce now i went with a little bit of curry and then i stirred again so guys as i was saying what is your favorite nigerian snack that you like me to share i now have posted a recipe on how to make meat pie and then i will post a recipe soon on how to make egg roll so watch out for that recipe and our sauce is ready fish sauce is ready now we'll set that aside now it's time to work on our dough so i'm just going to knead this for like two to three minutes till it is very um smooth and also 
you don't have to do too much it is not bread so just need for like two to three minutes and i just because i was enjoying the diet was not taking longer than that now i'm just going to give it a good knead <laughs> i don't know if there's anything like that after kneading for like two to three minutes now i'm just going to cut my dough into sizes so it depends on how many sizes you want but i think this gave me about six to seven fish roll so you give it you roll it out like this as you can see i've cut it you take your roll uh, your rolling pin spread it out in this way so that it can be easy for you to roll in this particular shape because this is the shape that most fish pie come abby fish roll comes in so you roll it out the way i have done make sure your dough is not too thick too because it won't allow it to fry easily so once you roll it out put your fish pie your fish sauce at the edge and then you start rolling it's so easy to roll just follow my um follow my instruction the way i am going about it just keep rolling like this i will do another one so that you can grab it at once and for the pros in the house i know you can undo it but those some people might not be able to do it it might be their first time making this you do the same with all the butter you can even cut excess skin out to make another um what's the name another fish roll till you get some and if your was in a fish roll is not sealing very well just put some flour in water and use it to seal the fish roll so now guys see what we have our fish roll i think i did about how many is this i think about seven to eight fish roll with that um dough i made now you want to use enough oil please when you are making your fish roll don't manage oil you need enough oil because the first time i made fish roll like i made, i did this recipe i will i didn't know that we, we ran out of oil so i was thinking i could manage the oil but almost the thing showed me pepper so you need enough oil because you are deep frying and it will just save you time and energy and it will not even allow your fish roll to go to waste or get burnt so you need enough oil to fry so just and don't rush it don't overcrowd the oil with too much of it because that way it will be soaking too much of oil and uh, fry on a low heat don't let the heat be too much so now see my first set of fish roll are out and they are very beautiful yeah they came out very nice so once it's going brown like that just take them out and then put another set till you are done with your fish roll so now guys are you enjoying this video is this video helpful to you would you like to see more videos from me why not subscribe to my youtube channel and also join my community and you can follow me on other social media platform at the abyssola on instagram and every other platform you get to see my recipes short recipes some recipes that don't even make it here to youtube till next time on my video see you guys bye